Hello, everybody. Failed successfully here again with Simulacra. This is going to be part three. So I figured we'd just pick right up where we left off. Okay, so we got a new vlog. Rejection, it sucks. From the Office of Admissions to University of Cunningham, we have received your application oh, no. for the School of Veterinary Science. We regret to inform you that you have not been shortlisted. Blah, blah, blah. We thank you. Blah, blah, blah. They didn't even say why, and they have to take three months for this? <laughs> oh, this is not helping! Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, you wanted to be a vet. That really sucks. That would be an awesome job. That was one of the first things that I wanted to be. That's, uh, a lot of respect for veterinarians. Please tell me it works. The data gone. I'm gonna... Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. I remember now. Okay. Everything is fine now. Data's still here, I think. The phone didn't reset. Uh, I mean, I don't know if everything's fine, but the date is here, I think. Thank God. Oh, God. Fucking scared me. I thought we're going to lose our progress. Yeah, I mean, me too. It restored itself automatically. Don't worry, I fixed it. Are you sure you didn't trigger it? Um, well, that seems a little accusatory because I'm sure he probably didn't or didn't intentionally. At least I hope not. I don't know. Maybe he is the killer. Who knows? Uh it, uh, it restored itself automatically. If it works, it works. I'm not going to question it. Yeah, me neither. This is too much weirdness for one day. Okay, here it is. I found something on her laptop. <laughs> uh, more clues, more spying. Uh, more clues. I mean, we are spying, but, you know, we're trying to help somebody, right? Something like that. There's some phone data backed up. One here, another one at a workstation. That means there might be more stuff on the phone than what you see now. We work with what we have. I'm restoring from her laptop first. All right, let's get started. Okay. It's, oh God. System restore, please wait while restoring advice. Do not switch, so switch off the phone. Oh boy, we're getting a lot of stuff. Okay. Should be done now. Yeah, Um, I would say that we got it. Great, more of to see. Got a whole chunk of stuff. This is so wrong. I mean, it kind of is, but I mean, we'll stay positive and not think about the fact we're prying through somebody's social life and private matters. Finding some progress. There is something else. I was looking through her notebook. It's just something you're not telling me. Uh, well, um, I've been helpful so far. Says in her notebook that she met someone on Spark. Didn't you mention that she matched with some people on Spark? I mean, aren't you kind of broken up with her or like separate? I don't know. They said they got into an argument, I guess. Maybe they didn't. Did I? Yeah, it's Taylor. Um, hmm. But do we want to tell him who it is? Didn't we already tell him who it was? Maybe we didn't. <laughs> Did I? <laughs> You did. You've been talking to this guy all this time. How much have you told him? Uh, I was very selective. I was. I didn't tell him everything. You better not be lying. Did anyone ever tell you not to trust what people say? Especially if it's online. What about, what about you? You're my online friend right now. Basic common sense shit. Well, you know what? You, I also don't know you in person. So shut up. Yeah, you're a stranger too. I don't know you. For all I know, maybe you killed her. <laughs> I'm a boyfriend. You better stop listening to his crap and do as I say. Stay on the line. I'm going to make some calls. Get to the bottom of the spark thing. I... I'm all of a sudden starting to not like Greg a whole lot. You know, I, I feel like... Uh, I feel like he's a little bossy. And he needs to watch it because I'm... <laughs> Oh no, it's another Anna post. Today's gonna be an interesting day. I can feel it. I don't like how she's staring into my soul right now. <laughs> I don't like that at all. Oh, I don't want it to be an interesting day. I guess she is all right. Um, I don't think so. Hey, Taylor. Hey, stranger, anything? Anna posted something on Jabber. Looks like she's chilling at home. I guess she's all right. Um. Something is off. You know? Maybe you're overthinking it. I hope I am. Maybe she just wanted to be left alone. 
<laughs> wow, no wonder you're single. Jeez. Let's get practical, Taylor. You should make jokes right now. Um, Practical? That's kind of in between, I guess, the two options. It's okay if you don't get it. I'm not taking this seriously enough. So what happened exactly? Did Greg check her house or something? What about the post? He did, but no sign of her. He heard a strange noise, but no Anna. Um, sure. Why not? It's true. What? Explain. Oh, yeah, we could just send him the recording, huh? Um, which one was it? It's not a chat video. Chat audio? Uh, which one is it? Sorry, I'm... At oh, not that one. What about this one? Anna? <laughs> not that one either. So... Okay. Which which one was it? Oh, God. Um... You're not allowed... Oh, all right. This ah! Here it is. Yeah, that's the creepy one. Did Greg send this to you? This is odd. Anna would have called a phone by now. She's okay. Yeah, and that's the other thing, too. I'd be trying to figure out what my phone was. And somehow she makes a post exactly the same time as Greg is checking in on her. Does this sound a bit strange to you? Oakum's razor. Uh... The simplest answer is most often the correct. Uh, the easiest answer is most often right. The obvious answer is most often true. These are all kind of the same. I don't know which one is technically correct. Uh, we'll just do the first one. Right. So let's say, hypothetically, there is a possibility that Greg somehow did something bad to Anna and he is hiding it from you. Uh oh. Always well, typing a book. Oh, no, he was talking. Just a random thought. What if Anna is deliberately trying to get away from Greg? Maybe he bombarded her with calls and messages to the point where she just went, screw it, and chucked the phone away. I mean, that is a good possibility. He does seem kind of pushy, so I wouldn't be surprised if he wasn't a great guy. Um, go on. Think about it. What kind of person Greg is? Uh, <laughs> I mean, he is kind of a dick. Uh, the phone's data was almost deleted when he checked her laptop. He mentioned that he got blocked from her apartment. Um, we'll just, we'll, we'll, because he is. I'm sorry, but he is. He's very rude. Anna's a pretty sweet gal. Why would she date someone like him? Being verbally abusive is not far from being physical. Well, that's true. Uh, he mentioned he got blocked from her apartment. Aha! If they indeed are lovebirds, at most, he won't have the keys. But getting blocked is a strong word. Maybe she's keeping him away. And that's what I wonder. Like, did we make a mistake allowing him to be in? I, at least we didn't unblock him, I guess, right? We only gave him a guest pass, so maybe that's better. Oh, we got to tell him everything, huh? The phone's data was almost deleted when he checked her laptop. This is troubling. Is trying to obstruct justice? I think he is hiding something big in the phone. Otherwise, why would he want to delete the phone's data? I, I mean... I, I don't think it was an accident. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know if he did it, personally. I, I think he did it. I mean, it does kind of really strongly point to that he did, right? But he seemed happy that we didn't delete it and that all the stuff recovered. So I don't think he did it. Said every guilty person ever. That's also true. All I'm saying is that there is more to Greg than leading on. Again, hypothetical. What else he told you? Uh, Anna met someone from Spark. You actually met Anna? Um, Anna met someone on Spark? Right. There is a possibility a hot girl like Anna would get matched more than once. Yeah? You're right. It's true. Yeah. I would never hide anything from you. You can trust me. Scout's honor. I like him. He's funny. I think before we move on, you need to confront him. Call him out. Uh, some new data just got restored. I got a new batch of... Stop making weird, gross noises in my ear. Ah. 
That's, oh, that was awful. <laughs> I got a new batch of phone stuff to look at. Um, I mean, I guess they're, they're kind of the same, aren't they? Like a backup? Yeah. Great, he's hiding something. I can feel it. If he did something to Anna, we need to know what it is. Remember to get your facts straight and ask about his actions and behavior. Maybe he'll slip up and tell you something we don't know about. Uh, I mean... It's true. Oh, I can't type anymore. Okay. I'm not allowed to anymore. Okay, so... Oh, boy. We got a whole lot of stuff. Dice roll. When your life is worth money. Okay. So a traveling thing. Kidnapping for a ransom. Uh-oh. Why are we getting this? Armed robbery is not something to shrug off. The ordaining will last no more than the robbers willing to hang around before undue attention or the police arrives. A kidnapping, however, is in the interest of the criminal to last long as possible. Oh, why are we getting all this? Are we, are we hinting? Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Oh, what's this? Looks like you're my receiver for the next week's company gift swap. I know the gifts are meant to be secret. <sighs> Taylor, chill. Wait a minute. I know it's gifts are meant to be secret, but I don't like giving gifts that you ultimately don't want. So I'm breaking tradition and we'll get you something you truly deserve. Okay. I mean, I guess I can respect that. I mean, something to the surprise, I think. But I get it. Um, oh, well, this looks a little interesting. Tell me... Uh, your body size and I will pick the perfect dress for you. Oops. Perfect dress for you. There we go. Uh, why are you wanting to get her a dress? Make sure to give me your bust, waist, and hip measurements. I want to get it right the first time. A sheath dress would be perfect with a tighter and firmer bust to pair with those long legs. You would look fabulous. Oh, so you're a creep. Uh, guys, as a hint, don't do this. Women don't like this. Unless you are, like, with them, with them, don't, 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 don't do that. Especially not a co-worker. Come on. Be professional. <laughs> Oh, rain. <laughs> oh, so instead of Amazon, it's rainforest. I like it. I like it. Uh, consumer myths and structures has been shipped. Interesting. She was looking up stuff about myths. All right. Was she like, did she find out too much or something and stumble across something? I got your application, but the boss is sitting on it for now. They're regarding the thing you brought up. Text me in the office and I will explain. Um... Okay, for my two week study leave, I was not heard from you since. I totally understand if it's not approved, I just need to know so I can prepare. Okay, so she asked for some leave for something. That's interesting. So she went to go clearly look for something. Maybe she got like lost? Another random thought. Okay, Mr. Posh. What if Greg. Oh, Jesus. Uh oh. Um. Hello, I'm looking for Anna. I believe this is her number. Yes. Hello? Oh, oh, this is hmm. Detective Marillo from the police department. Hi. We received a report from one of your neighbors. She mentioned that there was a suspicious looking guy entering and exiting your residence. Can you confirm if this is true? Call us if you wish to report a burglary. Thank you and good day. Oh, never, never mind you. That was probably just Greg. I bet he probably was not very careful about people not Another seeing him. Another random thought. What if Greg killed Anna? What if you killed Anna? Maybe kill is a strong word, but what if he hurt her or something and tried to cover it up? Maybe. And all you hear from him is a lie. But huh? couldn't we say the same thing about you, though, Taylor? We know she was talking to you. I don't know if they planned on meeting, though, I guess, but I he's a stranger. Uh, Greg, I need to ask you something. There's something on my mind. Is there? What's on my mind? I guess I need to ask him something. <laughs> the game wants me to ask him something. Uh, let's talk about your relationship with Anna. Let's talk about your attitude. Oh, there's something here, but I don't know what it says. Anna's place? What about Anna's place? Did you activate the phone reset? You are trying to delete evidence. Uh, did you activate the phone reset? That's less accusatory. 
I told you I didn't do anything. Are you calling me a liar? If I wanted the phone erased, why the hell do I back up the phone for you? That is a good point. And that's my only thing. I don't think he did it. I don't think he did it on purpose anyways. To gain my trust because you screwed up? That's true. I mean, that's true. He could have done it, you know, messed up. He didn't know it was going to pop up on the phone or that we were, that it was going to back itself up again. But, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to try to trust him here. Even though he's a jerk, I'm going to try to trust him. I hope you're done wasting my time. Man, you are rude. Um, relationship with Anna? Maybe I'm prying too much. He may not like this. So you're a shrink now. What is there to talk about us? Are you both still together? Why did she... Oh, that's a good question, though. Why'd she block you? Hmm? We had a fight, okay? How would I know that she would block me? I just need to check if she's at home. <laughs> Sounds like a troubled relationship. It's still breaking and entering. Um, yeah, I, technically it kind of is, but we'll just say sounds like they had some trouble. Couples fight all the time. Nothing a good talk can't solve. Um, unless you cheated on her or you hit her or you kidnapped her. I don't know. Um, something still doesn't quite add up to me. We are dating why are you bringing this up? I think she broke up with you. Explain her spark meeting then. Um, I honestly, I do think she broke up because why else would you block somebody, right? I think she broke up with you. It's complicated. Okay. Okay. So she did and he didn't want to. Got it. Figured it out. If she wanted to see someone else. She should tell me face to face. Uh, <sighs> Ooh, do we want to open up that can of worms? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea. Um, he does have an attitude. Sure, why not? Let's let's roll the bones. Let's we'll see what happens. What about my attitude? I have no time to deal with your feelings right now. You're verbally abusive. Ooh, that's a little tough. Sometimes you come off as rude. Can you be a little nicer sometimes? Um, we'll just say that. That's kind of the middle ground. The other one sounds a little too nice. I'm really stressed out over here, okay? I'm not sugarcoating anything for you. Just deal with it. He didn't hit her. Ooh, we're jumping right to the right to the thing right here, aren't we? Maybe she was running from an abuser. Okay, chill, I'll deal with it. Um I don't want to accuse him of abuse because we don't know that, right? Okay. Just just chill. We'll deal with it. Watch the sarcasm. What's with all these accusations? Make your point. Uh, maybe you're somehow involved. You're not completely honest. Yeah. I, you're not being completely honest with me. I feel like he is hiding. I mean, clearly he's hiding the reason that they fought, right? Your random person who somehow got Anna's phone. I'm not telling you any more shit. You have nothing on me. So if you want to start pointing fingers, make sure you have proof. Okay, I will. I have her phone. I'll find it. You're not letting things go, are you? I don't have time for this. I'm not going to entertain any more questions about my life. I have nothing on... You have nothing on me. I mean, I don't. Yet. Give me a little bit. I'm sure I will. I'm sure I will. I don't think... Let me... Ooh, hold on. Hold on. Where... Can we get to, to recent? Um... Okay. Promise me everything is fine. You are... Uh-oh, oh, here we go. If you're hiding something, I told you your present only comes on your birthday. It's not that. You are acting weird. You always say I'm a weirdo. Weirder than usual. An example would help. I don't know. Just a gut feeling. You're overthinking things. Promise me that everything's fine. I love you. Hey, you're mad. I can tell. You just, you don't just storm out of the house without saying anything. Tell me. Tell me what. Uh-oh. Here we go. I want you to tell me why do you think I'm mad? Tell what? Oh no, she found something. Uh oh. Uh oh, spaghetti -o. Okay, so we got that. Uh oh, we need the top. Top done. Uh, the corner. There we go. Okay, and now. Oh no, but I made that. Uh oh. Um, uh oh, I'm just making it worse. Okay, wait. Wait. Okay, how do I get the bottom left corner? Um, hmm, that one, no, that just made it worse. Okay, okay, give me a minute. I'm gonna figure it out. 
There we go, I got it. Alright. Uh-oh. Oh, he has an extension phone number with a little heart in XOXO. Uh-oh. Who the hell is Yolanda? Oh! Oh, was he seeing other chicks? You looked through my phone? I knew something was up. You could have told me. How long were you going to wait? I made a mistake. I can explain. Please do. She was a client I needed for last month's Target. We met a few times after work. She's persistent. I made a mistake. I own that. But everything after that was not me. Bullshit. Stop smacking in my left ear. Rude. Anna. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, no. Okay, hold on while I do this again. There we go. Got it. Oh boy, that is, uh-oh, that's a positive pregnancy test. Well, if that's a faded line, it's probably, must be right. It's inconclusive, but still, that means he did, uh, that's not good. Okay, you cheated on me and almost got her pregnant. Oh, Greg was a bad boy. Oh no, this is unreal. I told you I'm not allowed to just get rid of clients. Wh You're not allowed to fuck clients. Ooh, that's where we heard that from. Okay, well, we got some dirt on Greg now, don't we? Oh, here it is. God. What if I didn't? What if I just went on living Can do it looking me dead in the eyes. God, and he hasn't stopped texting me since. I'm sorry. What, what does that mean? It means you need to break up with him. I mean, Maybe, but not enough. Then why would he. You know what? I hope it's positive. There you go. I hope she's pregnant. Yeah, he always wanted a family. Oh. No, everyone's happy. Everyone's happy. Man, that's rough stuff. I am so sorry. That is an awful way to find that out. I still don't like how she's looking at me. I feel like her brown eyes are just piercing through my soul. All right, well. Hey, Taylor. Uh, Anna left him because he cheated. Caught red-handed. Or red-fingered, because it's in text. <laughs> okay, that sounded weird now that I typed that out. Who is the unlucky girl? Yolanda. Exotic name. You know, that sounds like motive to me. Messy breakup leads to fight, leads to things got a little violent, who knows? I think you should call her and ask if she knows anything about Greg. Like a second opinion. Get it straight from the source. Uh, I mean, great idea. Sure. I mean, we got her number, right? Or something? An extension, at the very least. That's a spirit. Now go get her, tiger. Remember, we are here for Anna. This is necessary. Find Yolanda. Find the truth. All right. Well, I think that is a great stopping point for now, for the next part. I thank you guys for watching, as always. I knew that Greg was a bad guy. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I just hope he didn't do anything to her. Hopefully I didn't help him. That would, that would suck. Um, well, again, thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, usual stuff. I hope everyone is doing great and hanging in there. And as always, have a wonderful day.